Hello world, uh, I've got today here a creation that I put together of uh, a Roman galley and for this particular one I have tried to use the hole from uh, the Viking ship. I had a spare hole that I got in a random lot of pieces and so I thought well hmm, maybe I could try to use that for something a little different and so this was uh, what I was able to kind of put together. I tried my best to look at a lot of photos online and try to see, you know, what color patterns were appealing and what the actual structure, you know, what, you know, may have looked like. And then based off of that. So, I tried a couple of different ways to build on top of the Viking hole. I, I don't really like any of them. They're all uh, kind of clunky and they don't really uh, mesh well, especially at the end where it curves up. Um, I really like how the hole looks when it curves up, but trying to build something on top of it can be quite a challenge. So, um, And it turns out that it takes a while to collect all of those large Viking ores, they are not readily available in large quantities. And so by the time you end up paying a couple dollars for shipping for each one or two, they, it can add up pretty quick. So it took me a while to get all of that <laughs> collected. It'd be really cool if LEGO could actually make like a historic Roman theme or something, something along those lines. Um, so we could get more actual Roman or Greek warriors into the mix. But, uh, so if we want to take it apart and look inside, I just got to undo the string. And then this piece here comes off. So I don't have it fully populated in there, but I've got a few folks in there rowing. A guy banging a drum and threatening to, I guess, whip them or whatever they did to their public servants in those days. Um, so yeah, so that's the inside. Um, just fairly simple, some extra supplies and all that. Then to put it back together, just put this back over here. And there you have it. So, anyways, I, I hope this was, uh, you know, more than anything, uh, inspirational. I'd love to see some other folks you know, build some um, more of this kind of historical uh, genre. Um, Greeks and Romans are pretty, pretty amazing um, culturally, and they got some pretty iconic um, things from those uh, those time eras. So, anywho, uh, that's all I've got for you today. Take care. Bye bye.